Hi, I'm Lillian. And I'm Felipe. And we are the Postmodern Family. We are Americans living in the UK, living a traditional life. We make three new videos a week, so we encourage you to subscribe. Follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, and become a patron at patreon.com slash the Postmodern Family for some extra access to us. If you go to our Patreon page, you'll find out that when you become a patron, you're going to get a handwritten thank you card and a signed photograph of us. Mm. It's only a dollar to become a patron. And then we have a dollar a month. We mm. encourage you to check it out if you're interested. Mm -hmm. Today, we're listing the five differences between the way Americans and the Brits celebrate Halloween. Number one, pumpkin spice. This is totally an American obsession around Halloween time. Uh, everything pumpkin-y comes out, so it's also true for Thanksgiving. But for Halloween, you get a pumpkin or ten, and then you carve them or paint them. And then with the inside of the pumpkin, you don't throw it out. You make pumpkin seeds you so you can like clean it up and bake things bake pumpkin seeds into a snack. The interior of the pumpkin you then use to make pumpkin pie, uh, pumpkin soup, anything pumpkin-y, and then everyone sells pumpkin spice. So you add pumpkin spice to your coffee, your lattes, you have chai, pumpkin spice, blah, blah, blah. Anyway, pumpkin spice is a huge and we don't have it here in the UK at all. The second difference regards high participation. That is to say, in America, nearly everyone participates in Halloween, whether children and adults. In the UK, not so much. Um, and I'm sure we'll get a lot of uh, pleasing comments about how it's a stupid holiday and Brits shouldn't be celebrating it. But just to say, Brits don't celebrate it that much. Number three, and this is true, I think, both in the US and the UK, but for some reason, adults think that Halloween is the opportunity to dress up in very scant attire, especially the women. I'm not sure why, but it does seem to be the trend in both countries. The fourth difference pertains to trick-or-treating or door-to-door or, uh, -door knocking. So in the US, as I said, everyone, a lot of part people participate, nearly everyone participates, and you go knocking door-to-door -to, -door to get candy. I had experience here in the UK. The first year we were here, we saw some people celebrating Halloween, so we thought, okay, we'll give it a shot here in England. I went and knocked on a, a gentleman's door. He opens the door and he says, the rugby's on, and he slams the door in my face. I got that feeling that, well, maybe people aren't used to pe strangers knocking on other people's doors in the UK, so not really kosher here. Number five is the fact that Halloween has its own season in the stores in America. So currently, probably starting in September, you'll start seeing Halloween decorations being sold and costumes everywhere. And you won't see a hint of Christmas decorations until after Halloween is over. So that means by the 1st of November, that's when you start to see Christmas decorations up. But here in the UK, Halloween's not like that big of a thing. They do sell Halloween costumes and a little bit of decorations. But right now, already in October, they're selling Christmas decorations. So generally, I think as I think we need to say that as Christians, we don't uh, celebrate Halloween in the way it's celebrated. That is with the whole dark, demonic, kind of savage, uh, blood-curdling, gory, mm -hmm. or, or perverse way. Mm -hmm. We are trying to redeem Halloween to, in the spirit of like All Hallows Eve, where we celebrate epic heroes of the past, and so... Christian martyrs. Yeah, Christian saints. martyrs and things like that. So we're, we're celebrating people that have done great things and have passed on to glory yeah. and into heaven in the yeah. past. And just because something may be similar in the way that people celebrate Halloween today and um, a cult like or witchcraft or some other kind of culture, it mm. doesn't mean that you can't take that back and yeah. celebrate it in a Christian way. Because I think, um, yeah, the, the way Halloween is today is, is actually a hijacking of what it used to be. I mean, it used to be, yeah, not, not so much about um, delving into the occult as much as it was celebrating, uh, you know, martyrs of the past. So that's what we want to do and that's what we do. But anyway, I'm really fascinated by the 
angst that Brits feel about the incursion of Halloween yes, here. Yes, yes, absolutely. Because I think they don't want to be bothered. They don't want to have、uh, a stash of candy、mm. or sweets at、mm. their door like every American is assumed that you must have on、yeah. Halloween night. Christians are also divided on the whole Halloween issue.、They、there are, are、yeah. Christians out there who think. Don't do it. Don't touch it. Yeah, you know they celebrate light parties where they、yeah. dress up in costume and. So they're doing、yeah. something on the same evening、um, together, but it's、um, I guess completely different.、Mm -hmm. Yeah,、um, but anyway. But they do dress up. Yeah, and we so we didn't even think about Halloween when we were first married or anything,、mm. up until having children. So once、yeah. we had children, I mean, we had to figure out, okay, are we gonna do this thing where you take them door to door? Because in America,、mm. you do it from birth. Like once、yeah. you're born, you get pulled around in a trolley, door to door,、yeah. trick or treating. And as you get older, it becomes naughtier. So in、mm. my teenage years, it would be knocking and running. Um, and then in later teenage、Egging. years, it would be throwing eggs at houses. He was、so. a naughty child, <laughs> naughty teenager. <laughs> toilet But, papering. Oh yeah, throwing rolls of toilet paper over people's roofs.、Um, it was yeah, boys will be boys kind of thing. Uh, for me, I just yeah, I probably did the trend and dressed as uh, uh, provocatively as I could on、mm. Halloween. Because、uh, it was like the thing to do. So anyway, we want to take it back for our children and、mm. celebrate it in a way where we talk about how we don't have to be afraid of things, of of scary monsters or ghosts, because、mm. we have the light of Christ in us, and 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 with Christ we have the power to drive fear away. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you enjoyed it. Leave a comment below if you have any comments on Halloween. If you celebrate it, if you don't, what you do, some traditions. Especially if you're gonna take five minutes of your life to complain about how Halloween was never celebrated in Great Britain until the Americans brought it.